Yo, what is good everybody? Welcome back to the channel. It is your boy Key, aka your favorite fighting game enthusiast, back with another video on Guilty Gear Strive. And today we're just gonna be going through the uh Arxis beta uh two survey and just kind of just talking, I guess, just talking through it and going through it and stuff like that with you all. And if you have any um input on anything i say or anything like that or if you have your own opinions on the game and stuff like that and you want to start like a dialogue in the comments below feel free to because i'm open to having conversations with you all about this game and what you all want and stuff like that as opposed to like what i want and whatever whatever how you felt about the beta and stuff like that um but yeah definitely down in the comments below uh, let me know what you think uh, about the survey and the debate and everything like that and also don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the boy because we are going to be bringing you so much guilty gear content when the game comes out so be ready for that all right so let's get into this let's get into how i felt about the beta and i'm going to um have uh i'm gonna have some some gameplay from a session with a homie of mine mind you neither one of us are are particularly nasty at this game um we could definitely we can definitely benefit from some training also disclaimer i only spent about a good two to maybe three hours with the beta and that's because um i was just busy i didn't have time um i and it was over the course of two days so like the first day i played a couple matches uh probably played about an hour or so maybe an hour and a half and then the next day after that i played with my homie and he and i played a first to like 10 or something like that um so yeah so my thoughts on the beta i'm also going to be filling out the um i'm also going to be filling out the uh the survey while i do this so if i decide to um if i decide not to put the gameplay or maybe i'll put like the gameplay as well as this would i'm not sure how it's gonna go but initially i just plan on putting the gameplay at the end but yeah so i'm gonna be talking through the um i'm gonna be talking through the survey as i tell talk about how i felt about this all right anyway so right now we're just doing my name and stuff like that age range <gasps> oh i'm not putting that part in <laughs> i'm not putting that part in age range hold up man i'm an old man i'm an old man i'm an old man all right so we're gonna get into it um it says please select the modes you played in guilty gear so i did play um you have to play tutorial mode i played a little versus mode network online i pretty much played everything honestly okay i didn't so i played like uh, a couple matches with my little brother um with my little brother on versus mode and then tutorial mode you have to play tutorial mode you know um Please read the following of the Guilty Gear Strive Beta Test 2 versus mode. Uh, versus mode was pretty good. I'll say versus mode was very good. It, it felt it felt really nice. The only so I guess this wouldn't um this wouldn't be something I would put here, but the actual gameplay and the movement itself I had some issues with. I had some issues with, but we're gonna get we're actually gonna get through this and then I'll talk about my thoughts. All right, so I'll, I'll talk through. Uh, I'll talk through the survey and everything, and then we'll get to my thoughts and everything. Tutorial mode. Um, I'll say it was average. I'll say it was average because, I mean, you have to do the tutorial mode, I guess, to get to be able to play online or something like that, I believe. Uh, network mode. Um, off online lobby. Actually, should I put bad? Because I don't I don't want to have to play a tutorial mode to play online. No, nah, no, nah, I'll just put bad. I, I'll just put average. Network mode. Uh, online lobby so online lobby is still bad I'll, it's still I'll, although like they fixed it to where like you can stand in those little circle things and then like you can queue up it's still pretty bad I, I don't like it personally I know everybody in the community has their issues with it but it's it's pretty bad it, it, it actually is pretty bad um let me see network match quick match now uh, network mode quick match quick match is actually pretty good i'll say quick match is pretty good because like quick match is when you're in training mode and you're training and then you um you lobby up mm, mm, mm. actually actually never mind quick match might be pretty bad the reason i say quick match is pretty bad is because i i have multiple times where like i would be 
trying to queue up for a match, right? And it was, and it would like match me with the person, but instantly disconnect me, right? So they need to fix that. They they definitely need to fix that because that was pretty annoying, actually. I probably would have played the the game a little bit more, uh, as far as like getting matches and stuff like that, if that was fixed. Training mode, uh, I didn't do training mode. Well, no, no, I did do training mode. Um, I'll say average because I didn't, I didn't put too much into training mode. So I don't know like how to, um, how to like set the, uh, the dummy and stuff like that. Like I didn't do any of that. I just legit just hopped into training mode, um, uh, played around with a couple characters and that was legit it, you know? Uh, let's see. Character visuals. Char now character visuals are sexy. Character animations are sexy. Stage graphics is sexy. Round start with the screen visuals. We'll put good. Mm, I mean, it's, it's pretty. Okay, so when, when they say round start with the visuals. When they say round start with the visuals. Let me see. I got I got I got to pull up some of my old gameplay. And to do that, what I'm doing is I'm actually going to my Twitch page and I'm looking at my VOD, which you should also do. Also, you should like to subscribe to this video to, uh, to this channel. <laughs> uh, let me see. All right, so round start with the visuals. Oh, okay, so that's what they mean, like when when the game actually starts up. All right, I mean it doesn't look bad to me. I'll say I'll say it looks good. Battle effects. I will I'll, I'll say battle effects are the actual like moves that the people do, right? Cause that mm, the words on the screen are still bad. I'll say that's good. Battle system. I'll say that's average. Cause the battle system is a little weird. The battle system is definitely a little weird. I'll say, I'll say good. Uh, I'll say good. The battle system is kind of. Mm, mm. It's not bad. It's not. It's not. I'm not. I'm not gonna do it like that. It's not bad. But they definitely did make some changes that I wasn't a big fan of. Uh, as as opposed to the first, the first um. Beta, the first beta. So I'll say good because the movement is bad. The movement is real bad. Like if, if this was just like battle movement, then that would be here or, or here. Right. But it, but it says battle system. I'll say good. I'll say good. I, I, th I think it was pretty good. Sound and effects, sound effects and stuff like that. Mm, I mean, they were, they were, they were good. Sound voices, voice acting is pretty, pretty good. Voice acting is amazing. I like it. Oh wait, oh, uh, let me go back. I missed something, right? Please rate the comfort of the online battle. The comfort of the online battle was average. And the reason I say that is because I, I ran into a couple people where we were dropping, we were dropping frames, fam. Like it was bad. It was bad. And I'm like, wait, isn't it supposed to have a rollback? Cause the first bit, I didn't have those issues. The only, the only issues I had was like, connecting online but well, like when when you, when you got into a match it was pretty good but this, but this beta it was it, it wasn't that good i don't know what's going on uh what are we doing um what do you find difficult or confusing about the match uh during a match number of battle system mechanics that was kind of weird um let me see name of the buttons p and k not really uh Controls that uh, such as dash and jump. Yep. Command inputs for special moves. That was kind of weird. So doing doing supers in this game is kind of weird for me because like you have to do a quarter circle, uh, no, a half circle, and then you have to like, and it, it's like it's it's like, what is it? Is um, half circle backwards to a, uh, and you have to hit six or something like that, and it's weird for me. The difference from pre from previous games. I mean, I was a casual with uh with most of the games so it's like mm. yeah it, it didn't really you know i don't i don't really know much about the last uh the last couple games because i want to play them casually so yeah number of battle system mechanics um because i still don't fully understand the game and stuff like that like i don't really know what the different like roman cancels mean because sometimes the roman cancels they'll change they'll change buttons i mean they'll change colors and i don't really understand that personally myself um if you're a guru right and you and and, and, and you uh happen to and you happen to come across this video definitely definitely let the boy know what that mean all right um 
how would you rate the layout of the following screens? The main menu, the main menu is cool. It's it's uh, it's easy to understand for me personally. During battle, during battle, uh, during battle, it is average. It's not it's not too crazy. It's not too, it's it's not the best thing in the world. But I mean, it's understandable. It's easy to read, or it's it's decent. It's decent. All right. Network mode, online lobby. That is very bad. Okay, they say cluttered. Yeah, it's, it's kind of cluttered. I ain't gonna lie. I just don't like it. I want to give it the worst. I, I want them to get rid of that shit. During battle. Oh, I didn't. I didn't even do uh, results after match. Average, average. We'll do that. How would you rate the design of the following screens? Uh, main menu. Mm, it's good. It's good. It's good. During battle. Mm, average. Results after match. Let's say average. Command list. I mean, it's, it's it's a command list. I mean, you know, character select, good. Network mode, uh, very bad. I hate it. <laughs> I hate it. Um, which character did you use the most? Nagariyuki, obviously. You know what I'm saying? We got to do the black samurai. Where's Nago? Is Nago even in here? Oh, there we go. There we go, Nago. Which character do you like the most in to get Strive? Nago, obviously. Tell us about your purchase plans. I've already reserved a cop. I, 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 I did it. Cause I, ha I had fun with Nago, and um, I want to bring more content for you all. Cause I initially wasn't gonna get it because I mean, you know, biking wasn't in the game on release, and I was just gonna wait until biking is released because you know, I was, I was like, you know, if biking is in the game, I'm gonna be real hurt. Which if she isn't, I am gonna be extremely hurt because I already paid for the game, and it's like, bro, really though. But also, it's just like, um, I mean, the game, the game was fun. The game was fun. And I, and I look forward to, to learning some more Nagariyuki. Uh, please select what influence your pre-order, uh, early access to the, uh, to the beta. No watching videos online, friends, recommendations, watching trailers, official website, social media. Um, let me see. I had fun with Nago Nago de Yuki. I hope I spelled his name right, or is it uh with the E? I don't know. Nago Yuki, and I am a content creator who plans to make content on the game. There we go. Uh, tell us about your purchase plans regarding Guilty Gear Strive Season 1 Pass. I already reserved the Deluxe Edition. I already did that. You know what I mean. Uh, what do you expect to get from the DLC? Maybe guest characters. I don't... I don't... A lot of games have been doing guest characters. tournament event i don't know about this right here other i mean you know um but yeah a lot of games have been doing uh have been doing guest characters like what is it um samurai showdown is getting a is, is getting a, a guilty gear character and everybody thinks it's biking i think it's biking as well which if it is biking and i can find a game for a cheaper price than what it is then i will actually get that game to play biking i shit you not it's it, it will happen it will happen if biking is put in that game and she's not in guilt. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna do it. I'm, I, I will do it. Please subscribe to this channel, like this video, and go over there and, uh, and follow my Twitch, so you know I can get to the point where I'm able to support the gaming with this channel, so, so I can justify this shit. <laughs> um, help, help, help your boy out over here, fighting game dojo, your favorite fighting game enthusiast. You know we play all of the fighting games. Play Guilty Gear, Dragon Ball, Skull Girls, Mortal Kombat, Power Rangers, all that. We do all of it. You know what I'm saying? Um, back into this. Guilty Gear Survival, blah, blah. Where did you learn about the open beta? Uh, I learned about it from social media, Twitter, Twitter. There we go. Uh, where did you learn about Guilty Gear Strive? Oh, um, like, oh, the game itself? Yeah, online, right? Right, Twitter. There we go, Twitter. 
YouTube, all that. YouTube, others. Yeah, Twitch, uh, everybody talking about it. You know, please select uh, the Guilty Gear games that you play. So I've played um, Exerd. I've played uh, this one. Uh, Yeah, and I think I've played another. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I, I'm not going to say any of these, but I think I've played these two right here. Well, I know I've played these two, but yeah. Um, what influenced you to buy a new game? Blah, 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 watching videos, blah, 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 blah. Um, let me see what my own personal excitement. My, um, uh, all right. I'm purchasing a new game. Do you usually buy standard edition or a special edition? Usually standard, unless like it's a situation like this. How do you usually uh, purchase an online retailer? That's usually what I do. Oh wait, there we go. Usually. Uh, what game genres do you play the most? Fighting, action, adventure. Uh, let me see. There we go. What is your favorite fighting games? Choose up to three. Okay. Dragon Ball Fighters. Obviously, do you have Skullgirls in here? Please have Skull. They ain't got Skullgirls. Y'all tripping. Okay, we're gonna put Skullgirls. Skullgirls. Second Encore. Ooh, Undernight. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay. And then we'll do that. We'll do Skullgirls, Dragon Ball Fighters, and um, Power Rangers. The Street Fighter is cool. I love Street Fighter. Um, you know, I love playing Kami. I love playing Wagner. Um, let me see. All of my... I love playing, like, my 10 different mains in Mortal Kombat series. Uh, but when it comes to... One, one, one being my favorite over the others, yeah, it has to be Dragon Ball Fighters. Power Rangers, Skullgirls, like out of, out of this list, because like I, I feel like I have a lot more fun playing these games, with the exception of Dragon Ball Fighters. Because Dragon Ball Fighters is man, it just it just gives me so much anxiety because it's like, anyway, this is not a Dragon Ball Fighters video. This is a, a Guilty Gear video. What is the most important factor about per purchase a fighting game? Uh, character design, game system. Oh wait, uh, price blah blah. blah. Or game system meaning the system that I will play it on PC or PC, Xbox, or PlayStation. Um, I would say player population because I don't want to play a dead game. That's kind of why I don't play. Uh, I don't play Grand Blue right now because Grand Blue is so hard to hop on and get an actual good connection, <laughs> good connection and a good match. <laughs> you know, what are your favorite ways to uh, uh to play fighting games? Playing online, uh, playing offline with homies. Um, let me see. Yeah, playing with friends. Uh, I guess that's the same. I don't know. Anyway, playing against various players. Story mode. I don't really usually play. St okay, I do play the story mode in fighting games, but like, it's it's not um, it's not what 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 brings me to that game itself. You know. Uh, recording video. Yes. Commentating, live streaming, yes, you know what I'm saying. We gotta, we gotta play, we gotta play these games on stream, and we will be streaming Guilty Gear Strive on Twitch when it comes out. Day one, I'm not 100 because I don't know what I'm going to be doing on June 11, but we will be doing it. Actually, um, should I stream day one because everybody gonna be streaming day one, everybody is, and I probably be watching their streams anyway, <laughs> you know. Um, but yeah, we'll, we'll 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 stream at some point. You'll see. Just you you just gotta follow, and then you'll know when I stream so you I won't have to worry about telling you you know what I'm saying on average how many hours of home console pl uh, playing do you do gaming do you play on average uh well see what, what do they mean on average is like an out like daily you know what I'm saying I'll say it's it's tough man because I, I play PC a lot so I'll play I'll say an hour of gameplay let me see on average how um Say like mm, five to six. We'll see. You know, we'll see. We'll see five to six. 
how do you usually get your gaming news youtube uh we do youtube they got twitter you know what i'm saying because we, we, we be on twitter and the twitterverse getting our information on video games but yeah i guess i guess they don't have twitter at least i don't see it right now uh okay yeah we'll do other twitter that's where i get my information all right um any i don't know um i'll just put i like the gameplay and movement from the first beta a lot more than the second beta um also the lobby system is really it's really bad it's really bad lastly please incorporate i spell incorporate one there we go please incorporate a wi-fi indicator because those matches where um things were a little laggy i'm thinking it's because the person was on terrible wi-fi i'm not 100 percent, but yeah um suggestions and stuff like that uh Um, I'm thinking because Nagari Yuki has a couple issues. That, well, I mean, I guess this is gameplay, but like, I feel like sometimes his his blood gauge increases too fast, and they need to fix that. But also, it's like the return on that is if you hit the if if you hit somebody with it, you take seventy percent percent of their life. You know what I mean? Like it's over for him. It's over for him. So I'm. Um, I guess I won't put that in. Oh, we're done. We're, we're done with the survey, I guess. Okay, cool. All right, well, that was... If you've lasted this long in the video, I appreciate you so much. Again, thank you for listening to me ramble about um, the survey and stuff like that. I know I'm not the most knowledgeable person on the game itself or, or even the lore behind the game and like the mechanics and blah, 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 whatever, whatever. But I hope you enjoyed um, me just filling out the survey, talking about what I thought about the game and stuff like that. And my personal opinions. Again, in the comments below, let me know your personal opinions and what you thought about the beta and what you thought about the survey itself. Like, did the survey allow you to... Um, basically say what you wanted to say uh when it came to this game and like give the input you wanted to give or do you think it was a little bit lacking or anything like that personally um for me i'm glad they didn't give me a lot of things where i needed to type stuff out because again i don't really know too much about the game itself and like the mechanics and everything so it's kind of hard for me but um you know it it out I, I feel like for people who um who like pros and stuff like that who know a lot about guilty gear maybe this might not have been the best um way to do it as far as that like maybe they, they, those are the people who probably wrote books at the end when they when they ask for your own personal information uh your own personal input but anyway i've been rambling a little bit too long i know you're tired of this video again thank you all so much please consider subscribing to the boy also uh follow me on twitch because i'm going to be live streaming it um, anyway, with that being said, catch you in the next one. Peace.